Hello everyone, today I've added collisions between the liquid and the voxel world. It's kind of invisible, but behind the scenes I've made major improvements to my managing of static voxels. I now build the compression library Z standard together with the rest of my code into a single WebAssembly binary. In the past, my voxel snapshot process, which involved decompressing, applying edits, and recompressing took around 100 milliseconds to complete. Now I can decompress, apply edits, and recompress in less than 5 or even less than 1 millisecond for less populated chunks. Now most of the stutters you see is due to me running the old code side by side with the new sparse compression and distance field generation to test that the behavior is the same. I hope to get rid of all frame stuttering soon. I'm also very excited about my new voxel compressor and general learnings of compression, and I think it may be fast enough to synchronize animated voxels. On the extreme end, maybe multiple players could be peer-to-peer -peer streaming sections of the simulation to each other.